Welcome back to How to Authority. Now, Android devices have a pretty cool feature called Quick Share, which is basically like its version of the famous Apple AirDrop feature on iOS and other related Apple devices. The way it works is that it either uses Wi-Fi Direct, establishing a Wi-Fi connection between two devices, or via Bluetooth as well, which is slower, but is used as a fallback if necessary. And it can be used by pretty much any device on the market that, well, isn't from Apple. It was originally intended just for Samsung devices, however, it was since merged with Google's own feature, and now all Android phones are able to use this feature to share files between each other. But it doesn't stop there, because Google Chrome OS devices, as well as Windows PCs, are also supported. But okay, how far back can you go? Well, pretty much any device running at least Android version 6, Marshmallow, is able to use QuickShare, and that was released back in 2015. For reference, that's when the Samsung Galaxy S6 line launched. So there's a lot of devices that are able to use this, and it's available pretty much worldwide, with a few exceptions. You know the usual suspects, including Iran, North Korea, Cuba, and Syria. Though on that last one, given the regime change that just happened there, we could see them getting taken off this list in the near future, and we could see QuickShare be available there as well. So how exactly do you use QuickShare then? First things first, you want to make sure that both Wi-Fi and Bluetooth are enabled. So you want to swipe down and make sure that both of those are turned on. However, if you swipe down again and go to the next page, you're going to see this right here, Quick Share. Now, confusingly, you don't need this to be turned on if you want to share files. It's only for if you want others to send files to you. So if I were to quickly go into that, you can see several options. No one, however, you can still Quick Share between your own devices contacts only and everyone. So let's just go say um, contacts only for now and then press done at the bottom. So that's how you set up quick share. But now how about if you actually want to send something? Let's say I want to share this photo of a squirrel I took in my garden a couple of weeks back. And this works on pretty much any file type, be it photos, videos, PDFs, literally anything, it will work via either you know, the Photos app or the Files app, whatever you want. All you have to do is just click on that share button that is always at the bottom of whatever file you have active on your Android device. So let's just tap on that. And as you can see, Quick Shares are the first option there in that hotbar. So just tap on that and it's going to scan for all nearby devices where you can send it. You can also tap on this button right here to generate a QR code which you can then send to someone and that's going to also share the file that way. So that's something you can use. So there it is, pretty much everything you need to know about Quick Share. What it is, what phones and other devices can use it, and how to send and receive files. So if you found this video helpful then hey, maybe subscribe to How to Authority for more like this in the future.